And what is up guys, Technicals here. We're back with the weekend switch up. If you're new to the channel, I do this every single week where I go through and decide what I'm gonna mine for the week moving forward. And I'd love to know how you decide what to mine week to week. So let me know in the comments below. I'm the Technicals, let's get into it. Again, if you're new to the channel, this is what I do every single week. I'm a yield miner, at least I am trying to be a yield miner because I only have a three GPU mining rig and I hope to expand that here soon. But I'm looking for coins that have a low difficulty that can mine a lot of with just my small amount of hash power. Now, if again, if you're new to the channel, uh, we're going through a sort of a moon, uh, you know, th things are going up really, really fast right now. So this is, for me anyway, probably one of the most uh, uncertain and stressful times to decide what to mine because everything's going up. I want to make sure that I, uh, I, I pick the right thing going up. Um, it's easy to mine when, you know, difficult when profits are low because you're just mining, you're just chasing the most profitable thing. But with everything going up, everything's got a rocket in its ass. You're just trying to bet on which one's going to, you know, take you the furthest. So, uh, a lot of uncertainty right now, uh, you know, flipping GPU rigs, doing different things with the ASICs, trying to sell some ASICs. Um, so this week is definitely interesting. First up, taking a look at miningpullstats.stream on their new proof of work coin section. Uh, looks like we got a new one on X11, ASIC coin, so we're not going to mess with that. Ursula on heavy hash. Uh, we did a video on that a few days ago, like an hour after it came out. So I got on that really quick. I'm very, very happy that I was able to do that. Waifu on a rum. We noticed that one last week. Uh, and the rest of them have been around for a while. I'm not noticing anything that's brand, brand new. A lot of X11 coins. I'm wondering what's going on there. Is it like, is, is X11 the new script? I just want to check over on Zagex real quick. Is that how you say it? Uh, Ursula, what the current price is. So it's going for about a, a little over a penny uh, per Ursula. So that's what, $10 that we were able to mine in one day with our three GPU rig. That's pretty good. Um, that's, you know, better. That beats uh, uh, whatever the mining calculators would say normally for, for what I would have mined with my GPU rig. So. You know, obviously there was a big dump in the beginning because I suspect that they pay their listing fees uh, on Zagex with the coin itself. And then Zagex doesn't allow deposits. They only allow people to buy in the beginning. So there's a massive dump in the beginning so they can get their money. I do the same thing too. Just speculating. Uh, but the price kind of, you know, falling down. But hey, maybe it will go back up. And if it, uh, if it gets back up to like, what, five and a half cents, that puts our thousand Ursula at... $56, so not bad for one day of mining on three GPU, three, you know, one modern GPU and two kind of older GPUs. So not bad, but that's Hopium, that's Wishium. Uh, we'll see what happens there. Next place we're gonna take a look at, Coins to Mine, uh, over on Minerstat. Uh, I, you know, I never really noticed many. Okay, so we got Decred over here on Hash Rate Losers. Not, re Bitcoin Gold, that one's been around for a while. So, but I think Bitcoin Gold's on uh, Equihash, I think. I'm not sure. Gainers, not noted, not recognizing really any of these. Uh, I don't really take any information from there. Bitcoin talk, I hit this uh, at least a couple times a day these days to try to jump on brand new coins. You know, looking through here, I'm not seeing anything that's brand new, uh, but it's, it's good practice, or at least I uh, take a look at it a few times a day. Let's check on our plant, our favorite shitcoin mining pool. Um, that's where the, uh, they serve up the hot and fresh new stuff. It uh, looks like they delisted Bitcoin 69, and uh, Nexelia is looking like it's a rug pull currently, but I don't know, Nexelia's fighting people. They're fighting rabid mining on Twitter right now, saying, I'm, we're not a rug pull, but, you know, I'm going to take rabbit's word versus uh, some no-name dev. Hey, that's just me. Uh, so, our plant not showing us anything brand new, and so we finally arrive at the place where we always end up, miningpoolstats.stream. We're going to sort by difficulty and then make our decision from this. What I do is I'm going to sort the difficulty by ascending. And if you scroll down, it says no data. So on a lot of these, you can't really tell if it went up, down, sideways, who knows. Once you get to about page five or six, it will start updating. And then we can start looking around from there. Then my eyes go over here to the volume section because I don't want to mine a coin that I can't sell or is, you know, on its way to uh, the grave. So then I, that's where I start looking from there. Again, right now I'm only looking for CPU coins and GPU coins. Uh, ASIC coins, I, I'm just, I stay on the main coin. I, uh, Bitcoin, I stay on Litecoin Doge um, with the uh, script miner. 
and I stay on Caspa with the uh, K-Heavy Hash Miner. I'm not too interested in, in breaking from that, but if something pops up, I'll jump on it. But right now it's just CPU, GPU. All right, here's our first real potential friend coin. I think we took a look at this one last week or the couple weeks ago when our, our GPUs were offline because I was building the shed. Uh, we didn't mine any of it, it's on Kapow. 27% drop in uh, the difficulty, um, but up 12%, so that's a potential. I'm gonna write that, I'm gonna write it down with a pen, actually, friend because I have no friends and I have no friend either. And if you're in cryptocurrency, you don't need friends anyway, because we, we got money or never mind. All right, here's another one, Chlor, also on Kapow. I do have some Chlor. I was mining Chlor a while back, uh, about a 20% drop in its difficulty, a little bit off on its price. I'm not sure if there's some news or something like that that's going on there, but uh, with 4 million in volume, there's a potential. It's got legs, so there are people who are invested in it. So I'm gonna write down Chlor as our second option. Well, that's spicy, Narai, which is kind of, it has, seems to be everyone's default that they run to and they can't figure out how to mine, what to mine. 15% uh, drop in its net hash, 12% drop in price. I'm not sure what's going on there. Uh, maybe it's just people consolidating into larger cap coins right now. Can't be too certain, but uh, definitely gonna put that on the maybe list because I do like, I don't like any of these coins, but <laughs> I prefer Narai. It seems a little, more solid. Bitcoin turquoise, man, I should have jumped on that. It's on Ghost Rider, 83% hike, 13% uh, drop in net hash. You know, so that's a that's a potential for our CPUs. You know, I, honestly, I, I understand because I was around. There's always these coins that say Bitcoin something else, Bitcoin private, Bitcoin turquoise, Bitcoin uh, Toyota Camry, whatever it is. Uh, you know, they're trying to capitalize on the the, the name recognition of Bitcoin. Um, so I, I, I'm not sure if that hurts it or helps it, depending on which way the wind is blowing. Um, I don't know what the hell Bitcoin Turquoise does uh, or why it's better. It, it's none of them. None of them are better. Um, but 83% is that as far as it'll go. Uh, maybe we'll take a look at that here at the end and decide for our CPUs. One more page because we're getting into the single-digit difficulty drops. Again, the market's going ape shit right now, so it's it's going to be difficult to really decide where we want to move. Uh, but we do want to move because I've been on the Oxa all week um, trying to uh, just pack up my node uh, on inodes. And I don't want to go invest too heavily into that. Uh, it was really more of a uh, just kind of a placeholder for, for while I was working on the shed. Uh, but we want to get back into doing more actual speculative mining here. You know, I suppose just for shits and giggles, let's check on what to mine and see what, what to mine and hash rate.no say. I, I begin to largely ignore them because their their data is kind of off, uh, but maybe there's some potential here. Uh, it looks like the most profitable for me right now, and again, three GPUs, that's it. Um, really just the uh, 3080 Ti is, is doing most of the heavy lifting there. Uh, Cortex uh, Ravencoin, where's that coming from? Bitcoin gold, kapow, another kapow, another kapow, another kapow. Uh, Ironfish is about to change over, so I'm not sure if that's been priced in. Uh, looking at for the difficulty, if anything's showing a big drop, uh, it's showing, nah, everything's kind of up because again, the market's high, so you know, where do you go with that? Uh, let's just see what hash rate.no says. Okay, so on our 3080 T, nice. It's on, it's, our, it's on Conflux and Radiant, uh, Hyper and Cross, it's of dual mining. Not Have not gotten into that at all yet. Chlor, showing Chlor up there. Xano, have no Xano, no, uh, has some AI power grid, uh, nothing really. And then uh, kind of moving down here. So what's my, what's showing my revenue at, oh yeah, it's, it's got my uh, power too high. So I'm at, oh, let's say eight. I'm at 7.6 cents. So let's update that. Uh, buck 21, I'm really only looking at revenue. Buck 21, buck 12. So not too much of a drop. I mean, the, the, the real division comes in here. Um, well, no, see, I'm not sure why Narada is up there. Maybe it's because it's on ProcPal Z. Uh, Narada's was showing a buck. You know, really, it's just betting, man. This is this is tough. Looking at Narai here over, uh, well, since it launched, because it's a fairly new coin, it seems less than a year old. Uh, it looks like when we had that big run where GPUs were cool again, and I got interested in it again, uh, up to about uh, six tenths of a cent, and now it's about half that. So, does it have room to run? Yeah, because it doesn't seem like altcoin season's really here. Now things are 
heating up, but uh, you know their overall market cap, 28 million bucks. Uh, let's compare that to Clore, 22 cents, and Clore has been around about the same length of time, and Clore is kind of approaching its all-time high. Um, so uh, with 56 million bucks, it is bigger than Narai. Um, not quite double, but it is bigger than Narai. So, you know, who's got more room to run? We're gonna check on Friend. Friend coin, two million bucks. And Friend has been around for not long at all. It's basically brand new. So in terms of, uh, you know, what the upside potential is, Friend, I think, has more upside potential. That is if it survives. So, you know, if we're entering a, a, a bull run, though, everything survives during a bull run, unless they rug pull. Uh, it's 30% down off its high, but that's, I would think, typical uh, when things kind of drop. So uh, let's check to see if it's, is it on any markets? It is on Zagex. Is it on Trade Ogre? No. So it's on Zagex, so we could mine directly to the exchange, which is not advised. Don't do that. They say don't do that, but everyone does that. Uh, so I'm thinking Friendcoin is where we're going to go. As far as CPUs go, I'm not seeing anything fantastic. And when it comes to the CPUs, I'm not as speculative on those because those do, um, they have a much shorter ROI window. And so I feel a little more confident in being just a, a steady, slow burn, you know, pay them off. I don't, my, my farm doesn't, I don't chase ROI. It's not part of my thing. I got a video coming out on why. Uh, but, you know, I think I'm going to go ahead and put the CPUs actually, I know, I know, hate me for it. I'm going to put them on nice hash. So we've got the CPUs on nice hash. I know hate me all you want for doing the new thing. I don't care. Uh, Bitcoin's what I really want. Uh, dollars is what I really want. I don't want Bitcoin. I want dollars. Um, it just means future dollars. If I have to hold Bitcoin, that's what I'm going to do. As far as our GPUs go, I think, what did we say? I don't remember. What did I say? I'm waiting. I think we said we were going to do friends. So that means I'm going to go get an address on Zagex. Uh. That's big pimping, baby. $12, $12 on Zagex, baby, $12. You hate me, hate me all you want for getting Pulse Chain, huh? Add some dust and Qcoin, got some Pulse Chain with it. I like Richard Hart, I don't care what you say. He's a shithead and I like internet shitheads. All right, so I'm gonna take my deposit address here. All right, let's select a pool for our friend here. Hmm, which pool should I choose? Actually, it's, uh, I usually pick the biggest pool because I wanna concentrate the hash rate because I wanna help facilitate uh, the network being attacked and overrun. Um, I don't, I don't care. I want, I want the most consistent payout because I want the dinero baby. So, uh, I'm probably going to go for, I prefer honestly pools that already have accounts on, which I'm familiar with. Uh, but it looks like mining for people is currently, uh, eaten up about what, uh, most of the network hash rate. It's 11, Network hash is 11.45, this is five, so I guess we're going for miningforpeople.com. All right, we'll give that a second to heat up and check to make sure that we're on the pool and go from there. All right, and there we go. Well, the hash rate needs to settle out a little bit, there we go. All right, so we are mining friend coin, new coin, the most upside potential. Let's go ahead and make myself bigger right in the middle of recording. All right, so that's my process week to week, just kind of looking around and going based on all the information that I have, which includes the comments that I get in videos below. So if you know of a hot new upcoming coin, please let me know in the comments below because I'd love to take a look at it, love to mine it. Uh, CPUs this week, we're going uh, on nice hash and on the GPUs, we're going on friend. Now this may change, we see a new coin pop up on Bitcoin talk or something like that. Uh, we're certainly gonna try to jump on that and get as many as we can, just like we did with Ursula, just like we did way back with Vish AI, uh, all the other coins that we've uh, kind of speculatively mined. So again, whatever your method is, let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel. Please like the video, so, uh, and let me know what kind of videos otherwise that you guys like to see. Appreciate you taking a watch. I'm The Technicals. See you next time.